when I can get rid of these super mutant missions. I'm really sick of them at this point. I mean, four missions in a row, nothing but super missions. Too much super missions. No variation, no nothing. Okay, do we have. Yeah. Time to give some first aid. We'll go from yeah, four from from forty-five hit points to full health. That's some sweet ass healing. I love the first aid skill in this game. Absolutely love it. It's also one of those times when you're glad that you took the loner perk. You could have taken less, some kind of damage resistance or damage, damage perk. So there's always a choice you have to make, but getting almost killed in these missions will will be quite a regular occurrence so having some strong healing ability is definitely recommended now these gas tanks can explode so I'm trying to get her away from them They're firing, but their aim sucks so bad. And then I die. 153 points. So... 153. As you can see, it's, we had 132. We can survive that, but it's not that far, so few levels and the life giver extra hit points, we could even suff survive such a heavy critical hit and that's what really what I'm aiming for. Not to resist damage, but prepare for the time when the worst happens that we have a chance to survive even that. Because I, even though criticals happen, they happen so rarely in this game, probably the 5-6% five, five, will be accurate that it, it pays to raise those hit points not less so in Fallout the role playing games in my opinion because critical hits are so commonplace there that no amount of hit points is going to protect, protect anyone from them okay this is probably where we want to be Yeah, I think our target is here and these are places where all of their warriors are hidden beneath or behind, rather. Okay, nice ammo. Nice ammo. Okay, I think I see what we need to do here. Yeah, we won't be going into that room. We'll be exploding those cans the safety of this room. Yeah. Now, 25 grenades. I think 25 grenades are going to be raining in that room soon. But I'm not going to throw any of them yet, because if that's the boss fight room, it's going to have a conversation I want to launch it before actually killing the target. Okay, who is that? It's a 
can talk Come to Gaborn! Gaborn, is that you? I failed you, my lord. <coughs> we all failed you. Whole platoon wiped out by that one monster. They crushed us. Those things, they don't feel pain. <coughs> I used to think the same thing once. They took my prisoner, General Barnaby. I didn't have time. Get any information from him. He's a tough nut to crack, all right. <laughs> Don't like mutants much either. You should have seen it, Gamorn. It looks like an angry god. Breathes fire and death. <clears throat> My death. I'm going to die. I... Don't hurt anymore. Why is it so bright? I hope it's not that damn robot again. Master. So... That's pretty much what we have been hindered all this time. Input clavier. Finding pieces of, of robot hand and enemy that everyone seems to lose against. And now a confirmation at last. Menace from the West is an army of robots. I could really use the bones hand hand attacks. I'm running out of action points against this mutant. Luckily this is this is the end of the mutants, so I think the future enemies don't have Yeah, I think they're easier to damage. But they're more dangerous in attacking. And the robots are in a league of their own, they're bitch to deal with, no matter what you do. Basically, because it's not just a, a robot you have to deal with, it's a, quite a wide variety of them, and then there are some gigantic super robots. And I have no idea what I'm going to do with those. Then there are melee robots that are also going to be a pain to ass. Because they tank like hundreds of hit points, are hard to damage, and they'll annihilate, annihilate anything that will go come to close combat with them. So you can see the problem. Welcome, brothers. Welcome. What a fine bunch of soldiers I see before me. If only the West Coast elders could see you, they would finally agree with us about sharing the Brotherhood's wealth of education and technology. But I digress. Do you believe you can stop the menace from the West? Your eyes give you away, brother. They tell me you don't even understand who or what the menace is. Robots. The elders have always been blind to what is not in front of them. But it ends here. The general is not here for you to save, I'm afraid. And you cannot save me or yourself. Now, show me what you've learned. I've learned... Oh, shit. I didn't notice the guy camping behind those crates. What the fuck is that? Shit, we have to run away. That's a flamethrower.
This is why the grenade tactic was invented. There's no way I can take on that flamethrower. But it's hard to throw grenades where he's at, actually. But we'll have 40 grenades time to practice throwing grenades up there. <laughs> uh, and we had some candidates for destruction here. did not sacrifice my very identity to be beaten by those I strive to save. Ask yourself what you will gain by killing me. Judge me not by my actions, but by my goals. This undead enemy will not stop until all life has been extinguished. Why can't you see that? Why? <laughs> 